What are some fun facts about peacocks? Do you love peacock birds? Let's talk about peacock in this video. Thanks to their exquisite blue-green plumage and spotted tail feathers, which fold open into an intricate fan. Peacocks are some of the most commonly known birds in the world. These birds, though, are about more than their feathers. And not many people know a lot about birds and how they live or interact. Peacocks are, in fact, males of a genus called peafowl, native to Asian forests. Peafowl are a type of pheasant and are capable of flight. Female peafowls, called peahens, have brown feathers and shorter tails that camouflage them and make them fly more easily than males. Peacocks unfold their tail feathers to attract females, but most of their displays are overlooked. Peacocks, or peafowls, as the word, peacock, refers only to the male of the species, are commonly seen in zoos, ranches and hobby farms in the United States and Europe. The peacocks, however, were originally native to the forests of Asia. These birds are members of the pheasant family and display many of the same habits as other pheasants. They are ground feeders, which means that they spend most of the time on the ground looking for food. They tend to live in forested areas and will hide to escape predators in tall grass or shrubbery. Peacocks are capable of flight, in spite of their large size. They are, in fact, one of the world's largest and heaviest flying birds. If a peacock is startled, it may fly to escape danger. Although due to its weight it cannot stay in the air for extended periods of time. Female peafowl are referred to as peahens. Female peaches do not have shiny, flashy plumage, unlike their male counterparts. Except for their cream-colored bellies and greenish-blue throats. Their feathers are mostly brown. Their tails are much shorter than males. And their feathers are not brightly colored. And do not have the eye spots for which peacock tails are so popular. Though they can still unfold them into a fan. Although peahens may not be as beautiful as peacocks. They have one big advantage over the species males, their flying capacity. They are much better flyers than peacocks. Since peahens do not have those long, voluminous tails to weigh them down. This means that they can more quickly avoid predators than males. A peahen's brown feathers also help her blend more easily than a peacock can into her environment. During breeding season, this comes in handy when female peahens have to remain for long periods of time atop their nest. A peahen will be much more vulnerable when nesting without the camouflage that her feathers provide. Pictures of peacocks normally show the birds spreading their tail feathers. The way peacocks attract mates is part of these tail feather fans. Several bird species participate in courtship rituals. One or both of them put on some kind of display in these rituals when a male and female encounter each other. This also includes the show of plumage and the presentation of some sort of dance or a particular collection of movements. A male and female will jointly perform a courtship ritual in some bird species. This form of ritual is believed to help establish a social connection between the newly mated pair. In other bird species, only one bird displays, usually the male. Such is the situation with peacocks. He first unfolds his tail feathers when a male peacock finds a peahen that he hopes to mate with. He will often step into the path of a peahen to make his presence obvious. He then starts shivering, causing his feathers to shift back and forth rapidly. This reflects light off of the highly iridescent feathers, making him look even more brightly colored. If the peahen is impressed with his display, she will, before mating with him, approach and mimic his movements for a few moments. Most peacock displays, however, end up being ignored by peahens, who seem to be extremely picky. Peahens are thought to try to find a male with the brightest possible plumage, because it is a sign of good health, which is a sign of good genetics. It is fair that her chicks would have a genetic advantage, and be more likely to live to adulthood if a female selects a good healthy mate. Thanks for watching the video. 
please click the subscribe button and the bell icon below. See you in my next video.